Today's devotional can be found in Hebrews chapter 11, verse 1. Now faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things not seen. Okay, so... First of all, you need to be able to be willing to love it. I mean, in terms of Heavenly Father and Jesus Christ, you have to have the desire to love them in order to be able to trust them and like love them in a friendship or just a very kind, loving way even a friendship is love. You have to have a desire to have a wonderful friendship at least with them and respect for them. And and then once that respect and love and compassion is there and that desire for a friendship you can put hope into that they might be able to help you have a better future. That they might be able to help you overcome your natural self and to become an eventual celestial being. You see, but you can't put hope into somebody that you don't trust. So trust needs to be put on the line first. Okay, so then once the f- desire for friendship and the trust of hope is put into something or someone, that love and that trust is evidence that that you'll want that you're desiring a better future and you're desiring course, we na- may not be able to see the literal beings of God and Jesus Christ, but they're there. They watch us every day. And we can see evidence of them wanting to help us in everything, in all good things that we see around us. All good things are of God, and all good things are of the respect and hope that God has in us that we might be able to grow beyond our current selves if we wish to. I mean, the Lord, as God and Jesus Christ, have plenty of respect and love for us. And this is seen ultimately in the plan of salvation that God created in and the atonement that Jesus Christ carried out out of love and hope for us. The trust and love that went into the atonement, wow, it's immeasurable. But it proved that he had faith in us, that we might be able to do things. I mean, of course, we didn't see the atonement with our own eyes, but it happened. there if we want to desire to have it and if we want to put hope towards it that we might do better and if we want to act in faith and embrace it it's it's there all good things are based on the hope and the love that God and Jesus Christ have for us and for our potential as human beings and our potential most importantly as sons and daughters of God. And it's up to us to to act in faith and reach out to those things and reach out to those opportunities. God's not going to force us. We need to choose to embrace the idea that we're loved we may be able to act in faith and do great things. But it's
it's up to all of us what we do with the opportunities that we may or may not see, with the opportunities that are plain but precious. <laughs>